Just got an update from Glendale Police a short time ago. They have confirmed that two people in their 20s were found dead inside an apartment right over there. Right now, they are not looking for any suspects, which is often an indication that this may have been some type of murder-suicide. Now, our news chopper was over the scene this afternoon over the Cortland uh, Arrowhead Summit Apartments shortly after those two bodies were found inside one of the units. Glendale police tell us family members of one of the victims had stopped by the apartment around noon today to do a welfare check because they hadn't heard from them for several days. When they went inside, that's when they found the man and woman dead and called 911. The family had not heard from one of the people involved, one of the deceased, and uh, they were the ones that made entry into the apartment, discovering both of the adults that had passed away. This is a tragic event, not only for our officers and investigators involved that have to see this scene, but I mean, just consider the family are the ones that encountered this. The family are the ones that, that saw this scene. They're the ones that reported it. it. It has to be, I can imagine, it has to be horrific for them. The apartment complex just released this statement that said, we are aware of the incident and we are working with law enforcement in their investigation. Resident safety and well-being are our priority and our hearts are with the family of those involved. Due to the ongoing investigation, we cannot comment any further at this time. Now, the names of the two people found dead have not been released and they are not saying yet how they actually died. Investigators are expected to be out here for several hours talking to neighbors, trying to find out if they heard or saw anything suspicious, combing for clues, trying to sort out exactly what happened here. Now, we did ask if there had been any calls, any domestic violence calls to this particular apartment in the past couple of days, past several weeks. We were told that is all part of the ongoing investigation. As soon as we learn more, we'll let you know. In the West Valley, Jason Berry for Arizona's Family. Jason,